Hello from Prague. I am near the Woloreta, where I stayed last night in this really cute, quiet, romantic neighborhood. And after being in the swarms of people in Prague, I couldn't believe it when I saw this because there aren't tons of people. Here we are, I sent the location. The streets don't have names on them here, but it, you can find it by the location that I sent you. And from what I understand, Chris wants me to mark a spot on his atlas for him to do one of his drawings. I'm gonna choose L17, Chris. So I don't know if there's anything more I need to do, but hey, here's the spot. There's a sign there. These signs are everywhere. That's not gonna help you much. I was looking for an X. Oh, X marks the spot. There you go. And I'm honored that you asked, so thank you. And I look forward to this project, you know, when it's completion, when we're our 70s, and maybe we can sit down and flip through your book. Are you making a book? I don't know. <laughs> but it'd be cool to see what you come up with, whether it's like a huge video or a book or maybe all sorts of things. So, all right. Thanks. Have fun. Bye. recommend going on this street and uh, there's some views over the door over the village that uh, are pretty nice so I had to pee so I came up on this trail that the old man said is kind of grown over and so I'm just gonna walk up there's an open spot here and maybe oh yeah um, I can Maybe do one drawing from here. So I'm taking this spot. This is my setup. Of course, camera. I put all my charcoal pencils, litho crayon, magic markers, watercolors, everything in a waterproof bag. Um, this is uh, charcoal, really soft. And then I have three different sketchbooks. And then it's time. I really love this view. Somehow I'm gonna I'm gonna try a couple of drawings, maybe in each, one in each book, and see what I get.
always remember to bring handy wipes. There's an added thing to the list. It's a little dirty. <laughs> so I'm done with the second drawing and I think I'm gonna move on because I'm getting all the little red mites and stuff crawling on me and it's kind of driving me crazy. Uh, and I want to go down to, there's a Bach, a uh, stream that runs right, you see it? Uh, down there, I want to wash my hands and get Rocky to cool off a little bit. And we'll go from there. I think that is actually out of the zone though. I'm going to double check. Okay, next. So I just got back and G12 really cool place yeah I got three drawings thanks Donna uh, it was fun until the next we're seeing I feel like I've got charcoal all over my face but I <laughs> Introducing an experience, an experience into the world of art. Let's take a trip. A trip into the mind. Let's take a walk. A walk through the environment. Environments of art, creativity, and creation with Christopher King Jameson. this inevitable trait of leaving a mark. You know, no matter how you decide to make your mark, do it to inspire. Do it with thought, content, and passion. You know when the grass gets really tall and you take your lawnmower and you make one line and you stop? And look. I love that. Right here will be the experiment. I'm really intrigued by the collaboration of marks and the process, of course. And the combination of all that, which makes an image.